extensions, SP gears, number of teeth 30, pitch radius 300, and put something to face with. Okay, select all, explode, explode again. Camera, standard views, front, camera, parallel projection, and select the bottom, edit, make group, and select the other part, all, and delete. Line tool, endpoint, endpoint. Select the gear base and delete. Select the tooth, make group, and rotate origin blue axis on red axis, press control and 12 degrees, enter, multiplied by 29, enter. line tool midpoint in group on red axis 50 millimeters and green axis 250 and down 250 and we can erase this line and now draw helping lines One, end points, okay, and now tape measure, end point, end point, 100 and 6.8 millimeters and this line is 74.7 about and select the line draw helix along curve first radius 106.8 and second 74.7 laps 1 and I use just 20 sections per lap and ok and the next tape measure this is 55.5 millimeters draw helix along curve Now this goes to first and second 55.5 millimeters. Okay. And this line, tape measure, 50. Next, 58.5 and draw helix fifty and fifty eight point five. Okay, and looks okay. <coughs> The last helix tape measure 115.4. Okay, now, now I select all the helixes.
and we can rotate green axis end point on red axis to the left 90 degrees and move on red axis 500 millimeters and we can erase these lines and now down part of the tip lines end point red axis on edge okay tape measure 115.4 and 80.7 select this line draw helix along curve okay and the last helix tape measure 74.7 okay and select the helices edit make group select the group and rotate green axis end point red axis and to the left 90 degrees and move on red axis 500 millimeters and it is the lines now from the root of the tooth lines upper point of the root tape measure end point 135.5 and helix along curve 135.5 and 110 okay and the last helix select the line and okay Select the helix groups and edit make group. Rotate end point and green axis, red axis to the left 90 degrees. And move on red axis 250 millimeters. And here is the lines. And the last help lines from the lowest point of the root and seven lines and select the line helix along curve now reverse this okay and the last helix tape measure end point end point 110 and 135.5 select the line helix along curve 110 135.5 okay hold control and select the helix groups and edit make group end point red axis 90 degrees to the left and move red axis 250 millimeters okay and now you use curve loft this face select and select okay and yes and 
here and yes we can reverse this phase okay and now select these groups and move to the right red axis 250 millimeters and curve loft select edge and here edge okay yes okay and curve it off The last edges now here and here. Okay, and yes. Okay. Now we have to close the ends or cut the wall somehow. Select all and explode, explode again and line tool, end point on green axis, line and line, end point, red axis on edge. End point on edge back 250 millimeters. And circle end point end point. Delete the line. You can reverse faces. Select this line and delete. Select faces, delete and curve off this tent. reverse faces now circle end point big circle and select intersect faces with model and remove the circle and delete faces lines and curve off and yes and okay it looks okay now the other end line tool end point 
green axis, line, and line, red axis, on edge, and back, on edge, 250 millimeters, and circle, end point, end point. Select this curve and delete. Select faces, delete, circle, big circle, select, intersect faces with model, and delete, and curve off. Okay, yes. Okay, select all, explore. 